our company is Citimax. We are from China, and we mainly engage in the biostimulants. It's about humic acid, lauric acid, amino acid, and seaweed extract. Mainly helps the farms the, to grow their crops better, and also to change the soil condition into better and better. Uh, my name is Isma, uh, we are coming from Turkey, exactly from Izmir, and we are manufacturer of all kinds of uh, fertilizers, uh, powder, liquid, granular. Having been a cabinet secretary in agriculture, and now moving to India where, with a population of 1.3 billion, they are able to feed their people. It's important for me to still passionately carry my agricultural knowledge to see how we can adopt the Indian model in Kenya so that we, they, we are not faced with uh, food security issues. So my name is Sandesh Parab and I'm from Mahindra and Mahindra Limited India. Mahindra and Mahindra Limited has got its presence in Africa and we have four regional offices. And our Kenya office is one of the regional offices and as we speak, we have uh, a team of expats and local people who are working in Kenya and other East African countries. My name is Mahesh Sharma. I am Head of Agribusiness. I am based in Nairobi. I am responsible for the sales and market development of the Kenyan market, especially for the small scale cereals and the plantation crops. Uh, as far as Alun Kenya is concerned, we are around uh, more than 35 year old. The trading agriculture commodity company. We are in this business since last more than 30 years. In fact, we we were more into the floriculture sector and uh, we are associated with so many multinationals. Okay, my name is Ketkar. I'm uh, from Bala Industries, uh, Pune, India. We are basically from uh, poultry equipment division of Winkies. So we are in this business around 60 years now and uh, we are uh, exporting this, uh, our equipments to many African continents in Zambia, Tanzania, um, uh, this Kenya, uh, Madagascar and uh, some Arabian countries also. Okay, my name is uh, Sachin, I'm from India. So we are exporting our uh, product under the name Save Green Bags. Uh, these bags are manufactured in, uh, in India, that's my company. Uh, the idea of producing these bags is for benefit of farmers. So how these bags help the farmers is the farmers can pack their crops uh, in these bags. Uh, I think in Kenya it's for corn or wheat or beans, coffee. Uh, when you pack the, your uh, grains or pulses or coffee in our bags, A, there is no infestation. You don't need to use any harmful chemicals which are harmful for the farmer and also his family. So from my personal point of view, it's Zambia, Nigeria, Uganda, uh, Tanzania and we are also talking for coffee growers in Ethiopia. So as far as my knowledge permits me, I would like to have exhibitions in this country. So this is strictly from my interest. Yeah. Uh, I'm Chandra Mauli Sharma, heading the international marketing of uh, VST Tillers and Tractors Limited, which is based out of Bangalore in India. We are a 50-year-old company who are making walking tractors or the power tillers and are pioneers in introducing new farm equipments for small and marginal farmers. We also have a four-wheel four drive tractors which are leaders in that segment, in the compact segment in India and uh, we are now venturing into global markets. Uh, my name is Doreen Fröhlich, I come from Germany. I was come the first time to Kenya uh, for five years ago but only for holiday. And now we have the business for, uh, we have original uh, German tools for cut the trees and saws also for cut the trees. Also the chairs for cut the flowers, grapes, herbs, or for roses farmers. We have a special uh, chairs. And then now we are a, a new uh, moving head. This is one head and you have five functions. You can mulching, you can brushing, mulching and brushing. You have a low cut and a, and a high cut. We are uh, from ASOCHAM. It is the Associated Chambers of Commerce and Industry, New Delhi, India. And it is one of the oldest and the largest chambers of commerce of New Delhi. 
and I am Deepthi Pant. I am director and head international from Asocham. So, um, um, as you see, Asocham has had a very big participation in uh, fifth edition of AgriTech Africa 2018. We have got uh, immense response from our Indian companies. Uh, you know, given the support from our government of India, Ministry of Commerce. We could have a support of uh, around, uh, you know, we could get around 55 Indian companies here to exhibit. However, you know, there are other companies also, Indian companies who have exhibited here apart from this in 55 Indian group, which comes to up to around 60 companies. My name is Anne Nyaga. I'm the uh, county executive uh, committee member in charge of agriculture, livestock, cooperatives and fisheries. The fifth AgriTech Africa exhibition actually it comes in June every year. It's actually an exciting time for farmers and specifically for people like me who are in these particular uh, offices because we are, able to ex uh, we are able to learn from all over the world about the agricultural technologies which are practical and which are useful for our farmers. So this is a great time of learning and keep on sharpening our skills to the realities that we need to be adapting to. Hello everyone. My name is Sanyal Desai. I am CEO of Radical Communication. We are the organizer of 5th AgriTech Africa edition, which just got ended today. We witnessed more than 10,000 visitors in three days, started from 20th June and just got ended today on 22nd of June. We have also witnessed a lot of visitors from East African nations. They came here to support all the exhibitors who came from different parts of the world. We had total 150 exhibitors from, from, sorry, from 20 countries participating in this exhibition. The farmers of Kenya, the agriculture stakeholders of Kenya has witnessed different, different technologies, innovation in the field of agriculture, dairy, livestock and veterinary section. We are thankful to the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock, Fisheries and Irrigation Government of Kenya for their continuous support and we look forward for their continuous support in the coming, in coming year as well. We hereby thank to all our exhibitors who have exhibited from various parts of the world, came to Kenya and showcased the latest and updated technology in the field of agriculture, dairy, livestock and veterinary section.